everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is Ade and if you're brand new then of course you're most definitely welcome and if you're returning back then thank you so much for coming back to watch another video here on my channel today today I'm sure you can tell that I've got a very special guest everyone say hi to my friend Syra hi guys so basically I've got Syra on here today to do two things for me okay the first one is I'm literally gonna get Syra to smell five fragrances from my fragrance wardrobe and get her thoughts on it and get her to rate these perfumes. And the second thing Sarah is gonna do for me today as well is she's going to also smell some of the viral perfumes that have been going viral on TikTok and also give her final verdicts. Of course, if you want to see what she thinks about some of the fragrances that I enjoy, please don't be brutal. Um, then please carry on watching. And of course, if you haven't already, please make sure you like, comment and subscribe and make sure you hit that notification bell so that you don't miss another video from me. So. Let's go. Let's go. You ready? Go. I'm ready. Okay, so right. We're probably gonna start off with start let's start you off nice and easy. What are your thoughts on the bottle? It looks it looks okay. It's nice, it's pretty. I think the decor of the, of the actual point is really nice. Um so, oh, it's magnetic. Magnetic okay. cap. Fancy, fancy I like that. Yeah. It looks very chic. Very expensive. And what do you think it's going to smell like in the bottle? Flory, I would say. A very, very powerful flower smell I'm, I'm getting from this. Yes, right now. I hope not, but yeah. <laughs> well, let's find out. Okay, let's so see this. this is by Maison Lancome Pivonet Frington. Yeah. Okay, so let's have a little. Just give it a little. Okay, okay. You ready? Do you like this one? I'm not gonna tell you my thoughts yet. Yeah. Like a spy, it's very yeah, floral. It's actually it's not too strong. Mm -hmm. Floral. Yeah. Very floral. I, mean, yeah. I like that. Yeah. Well, it's okay. not my normal kind of smile, but definitely like that. It's, it's nice. Okay, okay. Probably okay. not strong enough, but it's nice. Alright, we'll take it up a notch then if you're saying yeah. it's not strong enough. Okay. What you got? So the next one that we've got is called Oud Alwad. I like the bottle. I like the bottle. Like the gold. The, the, like the rose. The rose that is very, very pretty. It's so pretty. It looks very. Again, money. Like King would buy to his queen. Well, make her feel appreciated. Don't so, yeah, I like that. I do like that. It's a nice bottle. It's a nice bottle. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's see what it smells like and see if you are. And what do you think it's going to smell like? Strong. Probably a mix, I think I think it'll be a unisex kind of smile, so it's gonna mix in with both feminine and, and male kind of okay. but more strong. I'm, I'm leaning towards strong. Okay, cool. Hopefully it will. So let's have a little spritzer. More than like this. Right. Okay. Let it settle. Let it settle. Let it settle. That's the problem I normally have. Sweet. Mm -hmm. Very sweet smell. Okay, I can smell like um, it's got some sense of ward in there, I would say. Mm -hmm. Some Arabic kind of connection, honestly. But yeah, it's, it's a male smell. I literally get strong rose. Yes, a sweet rose, rose yeah. a little bit woody, a little bit oody, like you said. But I guess, yeah, it does give, like, for me, I would wear it happily, but it's too rosy. It smells like rose water to me. Oh, yeah, it does, doesn't it? Yeah. So, yeah, it's, it's the rose is coming through. So, it's too the rose. more it settles, if you love roses, yeah, definitely go for it. It's definitely one to have. But for me, it's too, too, too rosy. Yeah, it started off. Started off smelling quite manly and they're slowly settling into more of a chic together lady with, you know, with fun, the money. Um, yeah. Okay, okay next. <laughs> <laughs> next to you, next. Okay, let's go here. So, this is the next fragrance. It's called Al Ibda. Again, we need to find out who it's by, but this was a fragrance that I saw online. I thought, Love the bottle. I literally got this yeah, by the bottle, and I was just like, "No, whatever it is, I'm gonna find out." <laughs> I do like the bottle. The bottle's really nice. 
Yeah, so yeah, thoughts? Thoughts on the bottle? I like the bottle. It's mm -hmm. very, um, again, gives power, mm -hmm. money. Um, yeah, money, definitely money. Yeah. It's given me, I like the whole... It's given like it's, an Arabic uh, scroll. I was gonna say, like, obviously, I'm the swimmers, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, well, you know, they don't. But um, it gives me, like, when we be the grand, for instance, it's mm -hmm. very much like the kind of um, the images that we have. The page itself is very much like that. It's got lots yeah, of swirls. It's very, very pretty. I really do like that. Oh, guys. Yeah, so let's see whether you like the smell of this. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. I like that. That's nice. Ooh. Your eyes literally <laughs> now. <laughs> yeah, that's, that is. That is sensation. Yeah? That is the best way to put it. It's absolutely sensational. Oh, that is sensational. I feel throughout the day, it's just, it's one of those really strong smells. So you have to, like, I think you'd, well, we, I spray a lot, yeah. as you know, you know, you spray a lot. So I would spray probably a minimal amount of this. Because mm -hmm. throughout the day, you literally would just start resting. And then it's one of those smells when yeah, you pass somebody, you just Shh. literally, you feel like a spesh. Oh, it's so nice. Yeah? Do you know what? Like for me, I'm that fragrance. It took me a while to like it. No, no. I, I think like, it's because it's got that strong. It's that authentic kind of traditional. Earthy. I feel like earth. yeah. I smell like some earthy vibes in this. Yeah. Earthy. You know when you just want to feel light, but you want to still smell like you know you smell good. Smell good with it. So if you're having like a chill day, I don't know. Maybe like obviously we're here in Dubai, go to the beach, mm -hmm. you're going for a walk or something. Definitely, definitely. So is it like sweet floral? Creamy, woody. It's coming, it's what, what woody, I'm saying woody, but it's also giving the, the sweet and florals coming through as well on that. Mm -hmm. um, definitely more sweet and floral as it goes on. I think that's the best thing about these kind of perfumes. You just don't know what to expect. You know, if you have one particular taste, mm -hmm. you, like I go for the strong wood smells, but I've learned as time's gone on, that these sweet smells just really do linger, linger and they just grow, and you do grow to like them. But yeah, this one I like. I like this one. Yeah, nice. well, we're gonna so smell these again at the end. So now see, yeah, yeah, pockets. <laughs> pockets about to get rinsed again. <laughs> right, right. Next, this we have Browns by Ahmed Al Maghribi. I'm not gonna say anything. I'm gonna wait. It's one of my favorite brands. So, um, cute bottle, simple. I mean, hopefully, I think what they're trying to do, hopefully what they're trying to do with this is keep it a very simple look, but the mm -hmm. smell will just kind of blow you away. That's mm -hmm. what I'm thinking. What kind of scent do you think is a fruity, floral, oriental, udu, woody? Tell me. I'm going to towards fruity again for some reason. Why? Um, I don't know. Okay. It's the, the, the colour of the bottle yeah. and, and everything. It's kind of giving me that flowery kind of scent, you thinking. So. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's just these types of sets, I don't think. Oh, this is woody. This is, um, is it woody? What's that smell? That particular smell. Oh, what up? No, no. This is, yeah, this is woody. This is, this is nice. Yeah? This is like money. He's <laughs> like money, 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 money. <laughs> money. That's the best money. thing about these perfumes. So you know, uh -huh. a lot of them, you don't have to pay a stupid amount out of your pocket, and I think that's really essential. Um, really important as well. And um, you can get the absolute amazing smells, mm -hmm. literally for for next to nothing, ninety nine percent of the time. Um, and if you want to go a bit extra, there's definitely options there. There's you know, the options you can get drawn into it very, very easily. This, yeah, a woody. There's something else, I'm missing something. What am I missing? Tell me what I'm missing in this. What color? Apple, fruity. I'm not smelling it. I think once it settles, I'll probably smell the apple. Mm. Yeah, this is something that you, I would use every day, yeah. effectively. It's yeah, one of those day. every day going out. So I'm spraying it quite a few times just to kind of really... The only thing that I don't enjoy about this mm. is the fact that the bottle is too small. Mm. I'm a demo bee. I'm gonna need to um, make a small position for you guys to actually um, make the bottle bigger. I, I, how many mils is this? 50 mil. We need 100 mil. We need 200 mil. I think because the smell is so 
unique it's juicy yeah i get you juicy, get drawn into i get it. moorish as it's starting to settle i'm still i'm still not smelling apple you know you're not no oh god oh. i'm not smelling apple but that smells so nice like when you say juicy yeah I juicy hear you saying moorish, that. I hear that. like you just want to like smell like it yeah again. yeah i hear that but i don't smell apple Oh, there we go. Another one, go. one for me. There we go. Well, you're here to hear first, boys and girls. And then last but not least, the light of my life. I'm not going to even try and be unbiased because I'm heavily biased. <laughs> we have Rosewood by Arabian Oud. So, ASMR. Anyway, uh, thoughts. I love this. I again, without being biased, Arabian Oud is definitely one of my favourites too. Mm -hmm. um, they never fail when it comes to a strong, long-lasting smell, and and just something that catches your attention. Yeah, I think mean, that's really important. Whether it's summer, winter, spring, autumn, whatever the whatever time of the year it is, all of their smells continuously, Always. continuously deliver. Just, so I love the I love the whole. It's it's basic in a good way, you know? So they've got the whole gold room going on there and the writing and that kind of stands out, but they kept everything up very basic and stuck stuck to the, the title, Rosewood, you know, mm -hmm. it's, it's wood. And, you know, hopefully, hopefully it's not a strong smell of rose. I'm hoping, I pray. Yeah. Because <laughs> I would destroy my soul, but I do, I do love Arabian Oud. Again, they, they just do not go wrong. Well, let's give it a little, a little go now, yeah, shall we? I'm excited about this one. Excited? Yeah, this one. All right, so let's have a little look. See, smell it here. <laughs> can I just? This is the best thing about oh. Ravi Mood, though. You can, can smell it anywhere. Yeah, I love this. I love this. This is. Oh, it's so good. Yeah, this is. This is again another sensational smell. This is my favorite by by all means. I'll be honest with you. Yeah. The wood is really coming through. Um. Just, and I know as, as soon as it starts settling, it's just gonna be one of those smiles that you just love, and you just want to continuously, continuously spray yourself with. I, I would, I'm not gonna lie, but yeah, no, yeah. this fragrance won't even lie to you. Has me feeling bougie, has me feeling presidential, or like a president's wife wearing this. Um, it's like, you know, when you're going in like suited and booted. Oh. Walking into a meeting, yes. screens before oh, you even yeah. enter, mm -hmm. they smell mm -hmm. you before they see you. So if you're looking for one of those, if you want to get some attention, please. This, this, please. So I think, you know, it goes without saying that this one's your favourite. So let's go mm -hmm. on to the next one. So what would be your next favourite? And before you Ooh. say, we're going to re-smell all the ones very quickly. And then you're going to give me the top okay. five to one. Okay. Okay. Right. This one definitely ultimately my favourite. That's so ultimately. So that let's one. just We're even. That. Okay, so let's go. Do you want to smell this again? Yeah. That's this one. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the rose is really coming through now. Okay. Okay. This one. Ooh. Oh yeah. Yeah, I like that. Okay. Yeah? Okay. Last but not least. No, they smell like a fruit. I just don't know, I can't anything more with fruit, I'll be honest. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Yeah. Okay. So now that you've smelt them all now, you can rate them oh, okay. from five to one. Okay, okay. Let's go. Um, okay, Ray, obviously, Arabic Oud. That's number Arabian one. Oud, sorry. Definitely number Arabian one. Arabian Oud. Okay, then. It's a hard one. Okay, I like. Um, this one. Oh, there we go. Al Ibda. That one's number two. Definitely. Again, it's very strong, it's prominent, and it's there. It's there, it definitely catches up, kind of. As you're walking through the door, you can definitely. You can't if you're miss leaving it. or coming into the room, can't you know, miss they're going to know. They're going to know you. They're going to know. <laughs> they're going to know. <laughs> and then what else? I'm not a huge rose flowery. Flowers and roses, kind of. Oh, that's a that's a that's a dose. So won't give me them. Perfect, but <laughs> in a perfume, not no, a, I've never been a huge fan. But this, it, it settles really nicely. It is there, but it's not empowering. I think that's what I really like about it. Last but not least, I suppose this is your least favorite. That's definitely my least favorite. But and it's just expensive. After it's not giving all of them. Yeah, but this is a big, I just don't, it's just not giving me anything. Oh, it doesn't mean, like even when I smelt it again, the yeah. smell's kind of just disappeared. 
it's like there, but it's very, very faint. And I think for me, it doesn't, I'm not gonna pay with the customer I'm getting out. Something like that. Definitely, I wouldn't, I wouldn't waste my money. <laughs> okay, sorry, though. Thanks for being very honest. <laughs> Do you know what? <laughs> I don't mind this. <laughs> Do you okay. know what? On the days, okay, let me tell you what this perfume is given, okay? On the days when I feel like I just want to be a baby girl, I don't want no stress, I don't know, want no wahala, I just don't want nobody giving me any worries in my life. I put this one on and I just, you know, check into the Lulu Hotel and just pretend I have no problems. Yeah. And honestly, by the time I check out, I clearly can't smell it anymore. Because it's, like, <laughs> it's, but, <laughs> it's left. But I hate waking up from. This one is like got the lowest projection of them all. Mm. It doesn't stay on as long as the rest. And yeah, thank you for coming on the channel today, Sai. My pleasure. Really, really, really appreciate it. And then, of course, guys, if you want to see part two, part two to this is my friend is going to be rating tiktok viral fragrances so if you want to get cyrus thoughts stay tuned guys good luck bring, yeah. bring it back bring it back come on tell them tell the people bring it back <laughs> and if you haven't already make sure you like comment and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss another video from me in the meantime have a wonderful time wherever you are and i'll see you in my next video bye